Hey Pretzel Army, it's me Presley. Today we're going from noob to pro to hacker in Aquarium Land. Let's go. So we want to start by heading over to here and buying an aquarium. We got a clownfish. Oh, that's so cute. It's like Nemo. All right, then we want to head all the way over here outside. And then, oh, do we want to go get this clownfish from in the water? Okay, that's really cool. Let's go ahead and get that clownfish right there. Let's get this one over here. Catch all of the clownfish that we need for our little aquarium area. Let's go get this guy. And then slowly, we'll be able to get more and more of these clownfish. That one right there is the one that I want to get. There we go. So we're maxed out with five. So we can head outside. Okay, let's head back inside now. And then we want to head over to get ooh, all of these guys in here. And then five people have come in to see one little clownfish each. That is so awesome. Hopefully, I should be able to keep on collecting these clownfish and getting more of them to store in my little aquarium place. All right, there we go. Grab all of these. Yo, that was so easy. We've got four already. And I kind of just want to fill up our aquarium with like a million gold fish. But hopefully we can upgrade how fast we get things and our max backpack size because right now it is definitely not big enough. There we go. Oh my gosh, these guys. Okay, these guys are buying them. It's not an aquarium. It's a fish shop. All right, 400. That's pretty good. Let's head over here. Spend 300 on a little seahorse area. Nice. Earn more money with every new fish. So now we're at a level two. Let's go. Starter pack. It does look pretty good, but I don't think I'll grab it. Let's go into here. And now we've upgraded our capacity so we can hold even more fish when we're searching. That is actually going to be so useful. Oh, and we can plunge into here and let's get seahorses this time. Let's go. Let's get that one. No, we don't want that clownfish. We want this seahorse over here. Nice. All right. It's saying we've got to swim all the way out, but I don't think we actually need to because we've already got all of these seahorses right here. All right. There we go. Grab that one as our last one. Whoa, look at that. It's a massive whale and we've got a pink dolphin over there. That's actually really crazy. Let's head all the way back in though. Swim all the way back to the shore. Head into here and dump all of our seahorses into there. Nice. And then, whoa. Okay, we've got a massive line for people who want to buy our stuff. But let's head back out, get six more seahorses. And then hopefully people want to buy them even more. All right, let's get all of these. Uh, this little seahorse down here. It's not like, there we go. Now we can go over here. Uh, there's a seahorse that we want right there. And right there, we just need one more. And just like that. Oh, no. Come on. We want to get the seahorse, not the clownfish. There we go. So we can head right the way back in. Put five new ones into there. Okay, all of them are gone, which means there's a lot of people who want to buy our sea animals. There we go. Let's get all of this. Oh, my gosh. A $1,000? That's so much. Let's head back over to our upgrades zone. And we can upgrade our capacity. That's probably the best. And our speed. So now we've got fins that we can swim with while we're uh, swimming around, which is really good. Okay, let's go ahead, jump out like this, and hopefully find just some more, uh, some more of anything, really. Let's get all of these new seahorses. There we go. We're really close. We've got, we can get seven now, which is super useful. There we go. We're maxed out. Let's head back inside to get all of the new stuff. Okay, we can put all of our seahorses into there and two of our little clownfish. Let's see how much money we make off of. That's five seahorses, and that gives us quite a lot of money. It gives us about $600. That's really good. For five seahorses, 600 bucks, that's a good amount of money. Let's use our boat, though. Can we use that, or is that... Oh, no, that's a level three one. That's good to know. Okay, let's go out here. We don't want to grab the clownfish. We want to... We want to get those seahorses in the bottom corner. Come on. Let's go. We just want to get you, sir. I'm going to get you, and I'm going to get you. And swimming up much faster is actually really useful. Let's get that guy, and then head over here to get this one. And there's a seahorse. We can get that. Whoa, there's even golden ones that we can collect. That's actually really crazy. Okay, let's put that there. We are maxed out, so we can head all the way back. Put all of our seahorses into their little area. And then we can sell the rest of them over here. That's super useful. Then let's buy a lobster exhibit. Let's do that. So that all of the restaurants from all around can come and get their fresh lobster at the Pretzel Army Aquarium. 
Earn more money with every new fish. Let's go. Let's spin the wheel. And we got the three extra levels and three extra lobsters to start with. And we need a level four to get all of the extra stuff. Let's pick up a couple of extra gems. That's really awesome. We can't get anything just yet, but we can get a fishing boat. Let's do that. Let's get a fishing boat, which can get, ooh, dolphins. That's pretty crazy. So we haven't unlocked being able to get dolphins yet, but we will really soon. We can go over here and we can catch one of these pink dolphins. I don't have an exhibit to give them though. Oh, we got to catch them all. <laughs> Okay, let's get all of these guys. So now I've got a backpack that is 11 in size. That's really good. Let's put it all the way back here and head back inside. Hopefully we can use that boat whenever we want because that's really useful. And then we can put all of... Oh, we put the pink dolphins into here and all of our little guys walk through the tunnel. That's really good. So we can slowly unlock all of these extra things. That's nice. Let's go here, grab all of this extra money. 1,450 bucks. That's pretty good. We can dump as many lobsters as we want into there. And six seahorses can go into here. And let's go back outside. So we haven't got enough money to get a turtle exhibit just yet. But once we get the turtle... Oh, wait, we might actually be able to. If that is 60, 70 bucks, that is literally exactly 70 bucks. Let's go. Let's buy the $2,000 turtle exhibit. Oh, that's so cute. Now we can get turtles and everything. All right, now we just need more money to spend on backpack upgrades. We got a special key. That's a key to the city, Pretzel Army. We're definitely going to have to use that. And once we use that key, I think we're going to become a hacker. Let's use this boat right here so that we can get everything that we want. No, we have to spend two gems every single time. That's not good. All right, let's just go around and get all of these turtles. The turtles do take quite a while to, like, collect, but they're pretty slow, so it's easy to chase them. All right, let's get that one, that one over here, and down here. Oh, that's nice. All right, let's go even further out. And apparently, there's a key that unlocks that area over there. And now that we've collected all of the turtles that we can, let's head over here to the giant key to see what this unlocks. Oh, whoa, it's a cave! And Pretzel Army, once we go into this cave, I think we're going to become a hacker. If you like this video, be sure to leave a like and subscribe. I can't wait to find out what's in this cave. And I'll see you in the next one. Have the best day ever. Peace!